Councillor Arthur, it's going to become illegal to park on the pavements. How are you going to enforce that? So not before time, I think it's going to be quite a transformative change. So, so our parking team, the same people that enforce parking just now, they're going to be charged with the duty of also enforcing the pavement parking ban. And it will go live in January. It's still um, subject to government approval, is that right? So I think we're expecting to get the formal uh, power, if that's the word, on the 11th of December, and then the ban and end will go live in January. And how much will people be fined? £100, uh, but if they pay within 14 days, it'll be £50. But I, I really hope we don't lose any income, because I think if people respect this ban, I think it will, really will transform every part of the city. But, you know, areas like Portobello in particular, it's going to make such a difference to people's everyday lives, I think. Are there going to be any exemptions to the pavement parking ban? So the Scottish Government does mandate some exemptions. So, of course, for emergency vehicles, and they also allow delivery drivers to park where there's no alternative and they can leave 1.5 metres of space. Does that not just open it up to Amazon drivers, DPD, anybody, just to park there and say, oh, they couldn't find another slot? Well, they'll have, to, they'll have to take that up with our wardens, but I mean, I'm perhaps slightly naive, but I, I really do hope that in the coming months we're going to go through a culture change and people are going to respect the ban, see the benefits, and I hope these delivery companies will respect that as well and engage with it positively.